Hi, in this video we'll be looking at how to create a lookup field in Microsoft Access. Now we have our items table here with two fields, item number and item name. So simply if we go to data type here for item name, if I want to create a lookup field for item name here, I will go to data type section, click on a drop down list of options and go to lookup wizard. So I'll click on lookup wizard and there will be two options here. The first option says I want to the lookup field to get the values from another table or query, that is if you have these values already stored in your database, or if you don't have them already, you can choose to type the values you want. So we're going to create a list here with the second option. So we're going to click on next. And for this particular field, we're going to give some items. We're just going to use one column here. Essentially what a lookup field does, it allows you to have a drop down list similar to the one we just used to select our data type. So instead of typing in your values in your tables in the data sheet view, you'll simply select whatever value you want from that list. So let's go ahead and create a list. We will have flour for the first since we're dealing with some items here, sugar, and uh, let's make the third one salt. If you're cooking, you know salt is very important. We have rice and uh, some cornmeal as well. And finally, we will have tofu. All right, there we go. And that is our list. And we can go ahead and select the option for next. And uh, of course, we're going to leave the field name as it is, item name, and uh, we can choose to limit the list. We can also choose to allow multiple values. In this case, we will just work with single values and work with the default settings, and we'll click on Finish. All right, so once we have done that, all we need to do, we can go to our table. I'm going to save the changes here and I'm going to go to our data sheet view and uh, we can select from this drop down list now that we have entered this and created our lookup field uh, we can select our items here that we just entered so that is pretty much it for lookup field I hope that you have learn something from this video if you do remember to click on the like button and also remember to leave a comment and you can always subscribe thanks for watching